Hi guys, I'm Matthias and I want to show you today how easy it is to measure HMF in honey. Hydroxymethylfurfural is a very important parameter because the freshness of honey is determined by measuring the HMF content. What is HMF? HMF is an organic compound that rises from dehydration of fructose, especially if you're heating up the honey for easier filling. That gives you the chance to check if you have a fresh honey or you have a honey that's stored for a longer time. So also you can see if you have two batches of honey that were mixed before. Merck has developed a quick and easy test using reflectometry and test strips for the measurement of HMF. Now I show you how it's done. For the sample preparation, we need first two and a half gram of the honey. We dilute it with distilled water and after it's diluted, then we filled it up to 10 ml also with distilled water. What we also need, we need the test strips for the HMF test and the Ecoflex 20. If you have dark colored honey, you can using a blank strip to test if the color have an influence um, at your result at the end. So first of all, we switch on our instrument and for that we can also open then the box. We have here inside the manual that you shows you what you have to do. Also, we find here a barcode that you need to show the instrument which kind of parameter you want to measure. And then we give it here into the instrument. And also, we have the box with the test strips of the HMS test. You see here we have to dip the test strip into the sample and then also press in the same time then the start button of the instrument. And after two minutes, you get automatic the result from the instrument. We open the box, put out one test strip, close the box and then we also open the lid, press the start button, put the test strip one, two seconds into the sample and then we open here the lid and put in the test strip in the instrument. When the timer comes to 10 seconds, then you hear the signal and then the instrument is measuring the reaction zone of the test strip. So the result is shown here on the display and what you then have to do, because if we make a dilution of our sample, you're using a formula that you find in our application note to get the right concentration for your sample. I hope I have shown you how easy it is to measure HMF in honey with this quantitative method. We have also other parameters available for the reflectometry and for these informations please click on the link on the description or watch the other videos. Thanks for watching.